sunshines, welcome back and thanks for popping in. I am so glad you're here. I'm also really happy because today is part two of my Temu haul. Now, if you didn't see Saturday's video, you can go back and watch it after this video. But I talked in that video about how I discovered Temu before Christmas and I kind of went down the rabbit hole of watching Temu hauls and I was hooked. So I went to order some things. And before I did that, Temu reached out and asked if I'd like to work with them. And I said, yes. So today's video is actually sponsored by Temu. And because it's sponsored by them, I have a really great perk for you, which we'll talk about in just a minute. So if you don't know about Temu, they have everything, everything you can think of. So my first haul was like women's clothing, accessories, and shoes, but they also have kitchen gadgets and organization, which is a lot of what we're gonna do today. They have toys and craft supplies. They have stationery and office stuff. I mean, really something for everyone. Now, right now they're doing a sale where their Valentine's Day is up to 90% off, nine zero. Plus they gave me a code for 30% off site-wide that you can use in addition to that. So if you're a first time subscriber, you can use that 30% off code plus get free shipping. Returns are free with this. And depending on where you live, it takes about 10 days to two weeks to get your orders. And honestly, be prepared for how amazing the prices are because they ship directly from the manufacturer. There's no third party involved. They're able to keep their prices really, really low. Now, full disclosure, I told you I'm a little bit hooked. I already have about 28 items in my cart for another haul. I have everything in there from clothing to accessories to stationery to crafting. But if there's anything you have ordered before from Temu and you're like, you have to get this, please let me know in the comments below so I can add it to my cart. And then if you ever wanna see a cart specific haul, like maybe like stationery and planner supplies, or like this one's gonna be office or uh, kitchen gadgets and organization, let me know down below. Now, as we dive in, I wanted to say my name is Chris and I'm so glad you're here. If you're stopping by for the first time, comment below where you're from so I can welcome you personally in the comments. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Now, full disclosure, when this box came in, I was so excited that I literally <laughs> ripped it open. I couldn't wait. I wasn't thinking about having to show the box in the video. So I went ahead and unpackaged everything so we wouldn't have a lot of plastic like rumbling to here and we're just going to go ahead and dive right in now i get really excited and sometimes i forget to tell you the prices so i'm going to do a split screen when i show each product and that way it'll list the price for you but keep in mind that a lot of temu items come in multiple different colors like the sweater was in my clothing haul i just love it i love like a fun interesting sweater um this also came in blue but things usually come in a couple of different colors and also check it out because sometimes if you buy one of something which i have an example of that in here it'll be one price but if you buy two you get it a little bit cheaper um which is a great way to get and also fyi i'm gonna have everything linked below in the description box if you can't find the description box because youtube sometimes will make it hard, then just go to the first comment under this video. Just go all the way to the very first one and I will have it pinned and you can find all of the information there as well as that code for the 30% off. So let's go ahead and dive in. Let's see. The first thing I ended up getting were these. I did not take these out of the package. This was one of the items where you could get five sponges for 68 cents or you could get 10 sponges for $1.25. These are similar to what you might get at a dollar store, but I really like them. They've got the scrubby on one side, so you can kind of scrub your pans, and then the soft part. So I've got quite a few sponges in here. I'm excited because I needed to replenish those. All right, so this next item is so cute. Again, it comes in a couple of different colors, and this is a little portable humidifier. So say you've been sick in the bed for three or four days, and you're like, I can't lay here anymore. You want to go downstairs, maybe watch TV on the couch. Um, this is portable. It'll come with you, but it'll also fit in the cup holder of your car. So if you're on a road trip during the winter when it's so cold, you've got the heat on and it's drying everything out. This would be perfect to have with you. Great for a nursery also or a kid's room. Um, I just got the plain white one and it is rechargeable. It's got a little thing here and it does come with the, the cord right here. So this is handy. It doesn't take up a lot of room and you can just stick this. I have just a medicine basket here in my um, laundry, like where my towels are. 
And so this will be perfect to pop down in there and just kind of carry with you from room to room if you are feeling sick or just a little bit dry. I love that idea. Okay, the next thing I got, actually my son was home when I placed this order and this was something that he actually wanted. It's one of these little like cotton swab organizers. Y'all, he's 18, he's not 80, but he's not an old lady. But here it is. He's like, Mom, can you get me this? So I did. You just put your little, you know, your cotton swabs in it. Like that. So there you go. I mean, you got to commend somebody who wants to organize his life. So we're not going to rag on him too much. Okay, the next thing I got was a little portable chopper. So I went, went to make chicken salad the other day. And I just needed to cut like a little bit of onion. Or sometimes you just need a little bit of garlic. It's not enough to pull out your big food processor. And yes, I can chop. But sometimes it's nice to just have easy if you're in a hurry and look how cute this is so it looks like this on the top and then you can see this pulls apart and you do this i don't know if you can see it's got the chopper inside and then this goes right back in there so if you just need to chop up a little bit of vegetable to make your tuna salad your chicken salad you need garlic whatever this is perfect just to have isn't that adorable i think this one came in a bunch of different colors too all right, the next thing I got, I think this was like $3.18 or something. It is a little portable jewelry organizer. I got the pink one. And you zip it all the way around. And it's got a place at the top for your necklaces. And then they'll um, the rest will hang down in this bag um, so they don't get tangled. And then you've got a place for rings and then for earrings. I think this middle part, yeah, this comes out like if you are got big hoops or something and you don't need this middle part. I love the idea of this um, because Valentine's is coming up or Galentine's Day is February 13th. This would be great to stick a little cute pair of earrings in um, as a little gift. But things like this are great to have in your gift closet. You know when all of a sudden your kid remembers tomorrow's your teacher's birthday or you have a coworker and you're like, oh crap, I forgot we're having a party for them tomorrow and you don't have anything. This is great just to have at the ready. Three dollars, y'all. That's a really great price. Oh, speaking of earrings, I told you in Saturday's video that I would update you on these earrings. I got these. I believe they were a dollar eighteen. They're so cute, aren't they? Pretty. They're gorgeous. They're not heavy at all. And I told you that I would let you know if they like bothered my ears, if they made them red or itchy. I wore these on and off for three, maybe four days, and they've been fine. So really great, highly recommend. I don't know if that's the case for all of their jewelry, but these are. Also, I wanted to tell you, check out their lightning deals because they have hourly deals that are like incredible. So the next thing I got was this little organizer, which I put these earrings in. You could uh, put earrings in it. If you're a crafter, you could use it for beads or jewelry making supplies or really anything. I kind of want to get one of those diamond painting kits and that's actually one of the things in my order, spoiler alert, and I thought this could like hold the little diamonds, you know what I mean, and organize them. It actually hangs too, which is adorable. So many things you can do with that. All right. The next thing that I picked is so boring, but every time I go to the like hardware store, I forget to pick these up. And these are nice. You get four of them and they just go over your drain. So you could do these in the kitchen. Um, sometimes when my husband's like chopping vegetables or onions or something, the skins end up in the sink and they're not supposed to go down the drain. You can put these over your bathtub and shower so the hair is not clogging up your pipes. And there was two white and two gray. So I have one for each bathroom and for the kitchen. That They were just in a set of four. They're very nice quality. And they have little suction cups on them. I was very, very impressed with everything so far that I um, ordered. Okay, the next thing I got, tell me if this is a problem in your home. <laughs> My boys love to cook meat, any kind of meat, grill meat, turkey, whatever. But the most popular question is, honey, where's the meat thermometer? Well, it's in the drawer where it's supposed to be. <laughs> It's never where it's supposed to be. I don't know why. Um, and so I got this little meat thermometer. This was something like a dollar or whatever. You can look at the price right here. But that is just a basic stick it in. My husband baked a turkey the other day 
and you can find out if your turkey or your Boston butt or whatever you're doing is ready to go. So I grabbed one of those. I grabbed this set of hair ties. Came in this cute little tube like this. And you got, you could get lots of different colors. I just got black. Um, I tend to sometimes just pull my hair up on top of my head if I'm doing my makeup or if I'm trying to section my hair out to dry it because it's really thick. Uh, my cat, Lola, she loves to bat these around. She doesn't eat them. She just bats them around until she loses them under the couch and then she meows at me. <laughs> so I'm going to try not to drop these on the floor. Otherwise, we're going to play a game of can you get my toy out from under the couch? <laughs> All right, the next thing I got, I can only find one of these. I'm pretty sure my son took the other one because we bought two. He wanted these. It's one of those lights that go like under your kitchen counter or under um, the counters in your bathroom, like by the floor. So when you walk by, I think these are motion um, sensitive and it does have a charger right here. And it does have, where did I put them? You know what, when we took them out to look, it's probably in the bottom of this. It came with a two-piece set magnet. And so you take one half of the magnet and it's grippy. You just uh, adhere it to this side and then you adhere the other side to your cabinet. And that way you can pull it apart when you need to um, recharge it and then put it back on. And like I said, it's motion um, sensitive. So as you're walking by, you don't want to turn on the light in the middle of the night. You've got this guy. So he got two of those. And I think that's kind of a brilliant a brilliant idea. All right, the next thing I got was this little kitchen converter. It's been a long time since I've been in school. I'm 51 years old and sometimes I forget how to like translate things. <laughs> like this says one cup is 16 tablespoons um, or 48 teaspoons. I don't know. It just converts your measurements when you're cooking. This is nice. This is a nice, it's not like bendable um, it's got a nice huge magnet on the back. You just stick it on your refrigerator. It's just one of those things that are handy to have that you'll probably use a lot more than you think you will. So grab that guy. Um, the next thing I have, I don't remember what's in here. Let's look. Oh yes, okay. This takes batteries. It takes two AA batteries. This just slides, yeah, apart. And this, when you... I don't know if you turn it on. I haven't played with this yet, to be honest with you, but you, it's a bag sealer. So say you, your bag of chips are open and you want to seal them back because nobody's going to eat the chips for a little while. Or like, I love this for brown sugar. I always have one of those brown sugar, like terracotta bears, but somehow my brown sugar is just not like soft enough sometimes. So this just is going to reseal your bag. Isn't that cute? And I love how it hangs up. Such a good idea. All right, the next thing is this little guy. Now this is a little bit kitschy, but hear me out. I think it's such a great idea. So it's a little astronaut. It comes with a charger and it stands on its own. It's got um, several colors. I think this comes in like six or eight colors. So it stands on a desk or a nightstand. I believe that you can just tap this. Now I haven't charged it and it will turn on. So if you've got a little kid in the night that get, wakes up and is a little nervous, they can tap it and have light. I'm a night owl and my husband is an early bird. So a lot of times I come in the bedroom, it's dark. I don't want to turn on the light and wake him up. This would be perfect. I read the reviews on this and it had really great reviews. They said it actually puts out quite a bit of light. I think in a nursery, if you were you know, having to wake up in the night to nurse, this would be also really great because you don't want to turn the overhead light on and totally wake up the baby. And the head moves so you can kind of put the light wherever you want it. But I think it's kind of fun and interesting too, just on a desk. I'm going to use it on my nightstand. All right. The next thing I have, this is another thing that my son wanted. This is not, this wasn't really a need. Um, I can separate an egg, but he is loving to cook when he's home and um, he wanted this egg separator. So I said, yes. So we got that. All right, the next thing we have, I've wanted one of these forever. It's a measuring cup and you move this up, like that's a whole cup. And then this is like a half a cup and this will move. Let me see if I can, if I can show you, see how it moves. And it's got the different measurements, like a cup, a half cup, a third a cup, fourth of a cup. 
Um, now, obviously, this is not going to be for liquid. It's going to be for dry ingredients, but I like just having one thing versus like all the cups that I can never find because they continually get separated all in one foul swoop. My son asked for these two, and these are beautiful. These were like 99 cents, and they're reusable chopsticks. They're so pretty. I don't know the material, but they definitely are washable. He has fallen in love with sushi. One of his friends works at a sushi restaurant. They've been like practicing when he's home. And so I grabbed a set of those for him. He also wanted this guy. Now this on the website says it's like a tea or a coffee cup, but he wanted it for his toothpicks. <laughs> you might be a redneck if, I'm just kidding. <laughs> He went over his two things. So grabbed that for him. All right. So the next thing I got was a set of three of these little bag clips. Usually we clip our bags with um, like clothespins, but lately like they've all been breaking and these are nice. They're like big and the, the like spring on these is tight. So that is really going to hold whatever you need it to hold. That's great. Okie dokie. The next thing I got, and I got a bunch of these, one, two, three, four. I got four colors. These were like a dollar. Um, and I got a bunch of colors. These are just to like pull my hair back, like when I'm doing my makeup or if I want to section off my hair. I thought these were really, really great. So I got pink, I got navy blue, I got purple, and I got gray. So if you're doing like a Valentine's basket for anybody, like your adult daughter, these would be great. These come in handy and should be in every makeup bag, in my opinion. Um, on another note, I ended up grabbing these. And these are very like aesthetically pleasing. They're so pretty. I kind of got colors that match my hair. I'm, I'm just going to use these again for like pulling my hair back if I need to um, do my makeup. But what's great about these are they've got grippies. Like, I don't know if the camera's gonna pick them up. There's like little teeth. Um, so it really grips your hair. If you've ever had one of these and it's just slid down, <laughs> you know how annoying is this that is. And it's tight. This has got another tight spring on it, which is really, really great. So again, these came in a bunch of different colors. I just liked these kind of neutral tones. Now this next item, I have seen these everywhere on like TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, and it was on my list to order. I got a set of five. I think it was like $4.98, so a little bit less than a dollar a piece, and it comes in two pieces. So this is an adhesive, and you um, stick it to the back of this guy, and then you peel it off, and you stick the other part to your appliance, maybe your KitchenAid mixer, or your coffee pot, even your hair dryer. If you've got somewhere where you've got an appliance that has a ton of cord and you just wanna make it look neater, so you um, this will stick to your appliance and then you take the cord and you wrap it around this. It's gonna show you kind of on the picture what I'm talking about if you're not able to visualize, but you wrap your cord around here and then it finishes up like right here. And that way you don't have all of that cord sitting on your counter this is brilliant and a set of five these are really heavy and really nice too i have to say i was very very impressed with those okay the next thing that i ended up getting is this basket again this is something that i've seen on a lot of videos it comes out um one of my new year's resolutions is to like meal prep and meal plan so when i come home from the grocery store i've got to like wash everything cut it because We'll eat it if it's ready, but if you have to prepare it, sometimes it's, it feels like it's not worth it. So you can put your raspberries in here, your asparagus, whatever you're washing, and let it drain in your sink. And then you just push it back together and it will just go under your sink really, really easily. I think this is like four bucks. Super, super inexpensive. I loved that guy. Um, the next thing I got, and actually now that I'm looking, I think I'm missing an item. Oh, here it is, hold on. It's right here. This is along the same lines, but it's more of a colander. Now this came in other colors too, and look how big this opens up to. Like huge. I have this huge pot, 
And whenever I cook food in it that has to be strained, it's so annoying because I have to ask my husband to help me. Not because it's too heavy, but it's awkward to like strain um, because as it's straining, it comes up and scalds me in my face. And the strainer that I have now is like up on feet, so it will spill really easily. So I've done it before and had the spaghetti end up spilling all over the floor. So annoying. So I love the idea of this. You could still clean your vegetables. So it looks like this and then it, it comes down really small. So again, if you're in a smaller apartment, this will just go into a cabinet or a drawer really, really small. But now I can just put this over the sink and dump it and I don't have to ask my husband for help. So let's hear it for the girl. Nah, nah. Oh, it's here for the boy, but we're going to say girl. Anyway, the next thing I got is this little basket. This is nice, really nice quality. It's woven really tightly. Um, this would be great in a nursery for little baby girl bows or socks. Um, you could put this on your dryer. It would make your dryer look really chic if a dryer is supposed to look chic and put like, you know, your single and looking socks, those socks that you can't find the mate for, but you know they're around because you, and you don't want to throw away the other one because <laughs> as soon as you throw away that one, you're going to find the other one. Yeah. So anyway, I have a single and looking basket, but you can use this for anything on a desk with your pens, with your planner supplies. I mean, you could use a basket and the handles are, this is beautiful for the price really nice quality. I have to say, most of the items that I've received, the quality is really, really beautiful. Oh, I also forgot to tell you the shoes that I got from that haul. I told you they had a little bit of a scent to them, and I couldn't tell if it was the shoes or the plastic that it came in. It was definitely the plastic. I put these outside. Aren't these cute? I put these outside um, overnight in my garage and just let them air out and they're fine now. Can you picture these with black leggings and like a cream colored or camel colored hoodie? So adorable. So on trend. Love. Um, okay. What else do we have? I think we just have one more item. Is that true? Left. And it's this guy. Now this guy was a little pricey. Not for what it is. I think the price is really great and I've already opened it. I couldn't stand it. I needed to see what it was. And it is this utensil set. And it comes in like a ton of different colors. I just got gray. And it has like how many? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, maybe twelve or thirteen pieces. Now the front of it just says kitchen tools. I don't know that I really like that, so I'm gonna probably turn this toward the wall. But these pieces are so beautiful. They're a little bit heavy. They've got a wooden base. So obviously you're going to have to hand wash these. I'm just trying to use more of my nonstick coated pans because I'm tired of scrubbing everything. And the problem with my previous pans were that we were using non-silicone tools and they were scraping and then they wouldn't hold their nonstick Ness, you know what I'm saying? So anyway, um, these are really good. We've got a, a variety of different like spatulas, spoons. There's like a slotted spoon. This one's good for pasta because it kind of grips it. You've got the ladle. You've got the turner spatula. You've got the like, you know, if you want to baste it with egg or butter, you've got that guy. You've got the tongs in here. The whisk is in here. Really beautiful. I think this was around $28, but I got something similar to this in a subscription box. And I think the price on it, the retail price was like $60 or $70. It was ridiculous. This is a really good value. The pieces are just beautiful. And they're not, like if you look at them, a lot of times when you get silicone, it will bend, you know what I'm saying, and kind of warp. These aren't going anywhere. They're really beautiful. They're gonna hold their shape. So that was my Temu haul. Did you see anything that you're like, I need to go over there and check that out? Again, if you have any items that you're like, I loved this when I purchased it, um, grab it in your next order. Let me know. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you soon for another one, guys. Bye-bye.